Amazon Cloud Watch Alarm can now trigger AWS Lambda function as a state change action. This will undoubtedly simplify your automated remediation response architecture. Let's take a look. For this demo, I will create one CloudWatch alarm against the CPU utilization of this EC2 instance. When the CPU utilization will cross 80% threshold, this Lambda function will be invoked as an alarm action. Let's print the event object to see what CloudWatch delivers in the JSON payload to the Lambda function. Open CloudWatch console and click create alarm. Click select metric, EC2, per instance matrix, then choose CPU utilization matrix for the EC2 instance. Select metric. For this demo, let's change the recommended period 5 minutes to 1 minute and data points 1 out of 1. Click next. Previously, 4 supported alarm actions was there. SNS notification, auto scaling action, EC2 action and system manager action. Now it supports lambda action. Click add lambda action. Choose one of the alarm state. You can select the lambda function from this account or you can enter function ARN or cross account. Select the lambda function. Here you can select different function version or function alias. Click next. Optionally provide the alarm name and click next. Finally review and click create alarm. Let's connect to EC2 instance. Let's install stress utility for the purpose of CPU load generation. Run stress command to generate some load. Open the CloudWatch alarm and keep eye on this graph. Currently alarm state is OK. Here CPU utilization crossed 80%. So alarm state is in alarm. Click history. And we can see it failed to execute the action because we have not provided Lambda invoke action permission. Let's kill the stress process. Open the Lambda function. Click configuration, then permission. Now we will add necessary permission to research based policy. Select AWS service. CloudWatch alarm is not there, so select other. Enter unique statement ID. Provide the principal lambda.alarms.cloudwatch.amazonaws.com. For alarm ARN, go to CloudWatch. Click this item and, and copy the alarm ARN from here. Paste the ARN. Select lambda invoke function action. Click save and we are good to go. Alarm state is OK now. Let's generate load again using stress command. Open CloudWatch alarm and wait for the state change from OK to in alarm. Open history and now we can see successfully executed action. Open the lambda function, click monitor and check for invocation cloud metrics. As expected, we can see one invocation here. Click view CloudWatch logs, log stream. Here we can see the complete event object. It contains alarm name, state, data points, and also the alarm configuration. Thanks for watching.